Hello, my name is Daniele and I'm here to present to you my work called Effects of Support Nature over Latin American Known Particles Propagated by in situ Techniques that has been developed at the University of Campinas. The understanding of mental support interaction is of great interest in the design of new catalysts. Here, one of our goals is to understand how mental support interaction affects the final properties of an alloy catalyst, as composition, stability, and size, among others. For this, the approach of using performing nonparticle support on distinct supports was taken. The colloidal method was chosen to synthesize the nonparticles once it allows great control of size, shape, and composition of the particles. So, the experimental protocol for these materials is divided in the synthesis of platinum American nanoparticles, a colloidal method that is done using Chilean techniques as shown above. The performing nanoparticles are supported on silica or aluminum. These catalysts are activated by ligand removal using calcination and oxygen. And then they are tested for the water gas shift reaction from 220 to 400 degree. As main results, several techniques confirm the formation of platinum nickel nanoparticles from colloidal method in the desired composition structure. The support catalysts were submitted under redox treatment followed by in situ XRD that reveals that support type has influence in the nickel incorporation of the reductive atmosphere. Also, under reducing conditions, it was found silica support favors the formation of an effective alloy structure that has impact on how CO molecule interacts with the nanoparticle surface. This difference is reflected in the catalyst behavior of these materials for water gas shaped reaction, being the catalyst of platinum, nickel, and silica the most active. As conclusions in this work, platinum, nickel, nanoparticles were obtained with high control, and the in-situ techniques reveal difference in the nanoparticle's composition as an influence of support type. These differences are well related to the catalytic activity found for the water gas shift reaction, being the nanoparticle silica catalyst the most active in these conditions. This work contributes to understanding how alloy can be studied under reaction conditions for the design of more active catalysts. I thank these funding agencies and institutes. And these are my references. Thank you.